Okay, a really interesting problem today, and I'm going to show you two ways that you might use bar models to solve this. Um, okay, two fields contain some horses. There are 18 more horses in field A than in field B. 33 horses are moved from field A to field B, and there are now 150% more horses in field B than there are in field A. And the question we're asked is how many horses were in field B at the start? Okay, so as I said, I'm going to do two methods here with number one. I'm actually going to start by drawing a block for field B. Okay, so this represents the horses that were in field B at the start. And if that was what was in field B, then we know that in field A we have as many horses, okay, that would be the same amount, plus I'm going to draw an amount to represent the 18 more horses that we have in field A. Okay, so that's 18. All right, so that's the situation at the beginning. So then what happens? We, 33 horses are moved from field A to field B. Okay, so, and then resulting in there being 150% more horses in field B than in field A. So that's going to go, so that's more than the 18 that we have here. So let's say we're going to go back to um, here, all right, that these are the horses that are going to move all right there's 33 33 horses are going to move to field b all right so let's say if that is what's going to be left in a okay all right so if that's going to be the hundred percent okay that's the 100% then we need 150% here okay so we're going to this is the new field B and we've had the 33 horses move to field B so that's the situation at the beginning yes yeah, so of field B let's do this is field B at the beginning remember okay so this 33 is going to be added on here this that the 33 horses now we know that what what do we know we know that this part here is 18 okay because we've got that from here we've got okay so this is 18 all right if that's 18 then this bit here must be 15 okay because 33 take away 18 is 15 all right so that's 15 this is also 15 here okay that's 15 there all right so 15 18 that's the 33 the 18 the 15 is been added on to field b now if that's 50 if this is 15 then this bit must be 15 as well Okay, and what we know is that if this is the 100%, this is the 150%. Okay, 150%. And we now know that 150% here is 15 plus 15 plus the 18. Okay, so this is um, 48. And if so that's 150% is 48, so 48, okay, we can divide that by 3, that gives us 16, okay, so 16 times 2 gives us 32, that, that tells us what this amount is here, 32, okay, these, this bit here, what was um, there, that's what we have in field A now. Now if that's 32, and that's 15, that, remember that blue bit, that's what was in field B at the beginning. So 32 add 15 is 47. So there are 47 horses in B at the start, okay?
Okay, I hope so. That's that's um the first way of of looking at it. Okay, here is another way. Method two. All right. Um. So this is so what I was thinking for for method two is I I looked first at the end situation and the end situation. Um, I've got field A. Okay, so that's field A and field B. So I've got field A and I've got 150% more in field B. Okay, so there we go. That's 150% more. Okay, and I'm going to divide this up. So what have I got here? I've got here seven parts. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven parts in my model. Okay, that represents the, the end situation. Um, what I'd like to do is imagine um, how could I redistribute those parts so that um, I had half, I had the same amount in each. Okay, so A, B, if I, so seven divided by two is three and a half. So if I put three and a half in each field, three and a half parts, okay, of that original seven. Okay, and I'm going to divide it up like that so that all the parts are equal. Okay, and the reason I'm doing that is because here at the at the start we know that eighteen there were eighteen more horses in A, so half of eighteen is nine. If we had just put nine horses in field B, then they would have had the same. Okay, wouldn't they? All right, so. The difference, so here now I've put, this is the, uh, the same as if I'd put nine horses into field B, okay? And what I have now is I can then see what's the difference between when I have 150% in B and when I have the, the nine in B. Here, this was when I'd added the 33 horses. This was plus 33 horses, okay? This was when it was just nine horses. 33 take away nine gives me 24, okay? So I now know that the difference between this model and this model, okay, is 24. All right. So the the difference in the in their size here, and I know that the the difference is three of these pieces. Yes, one. This is the difference here. That's the difference between this and this. Okay. So if I do twenty four divided by three gives me eight. Okay, so I then can just see how many of these um, portions there are, how many eights there are. Okay, so here, for example, that be two, four, six, eight, ten. So in the end here, I had 80 horses. All right, in field B at the end, I had 80 horses. Yeah, can you see that? So how many of these halves okay so two four six eight ten times eight gives me 80 horses and if I subtract um, 33 because that's how many horses were added in from 80 that gives me the 47 all right so 47 horses in B at the start um, I hope that makes sense as well so there's not always just the one way to do it